it's kind of perfect timing for us to do this because I just saw earlier this week on social media, he said, Hey guys, Matt McKeever here. So I got some big news for you about my channel. Wait, that doesn't do justice. Hey guys, Matt McKeever here. So I got some crazy news for you about my channel. That that still doesn't do justice. So I got some insane news for you about my YouTube channel. Yeah, I'm gonna be moving to Winnipeg because of this YouTube channel. The thumbnail you clicked wasn't just clickbait. How'd we end up getting there? Well, it's all because of, wait, actually before we get into it, let's take a step back and look about how we got here over the last year. Hey guys, Matt McKeever here. So a quick backstory on myself and my YouTube channel. At the start of 2016, I had no social media presence whatsoever. No YouTube account, no Facebook, no Twitter, no Instagram, no Snapchat, no nothing. Then my work situation started to change. There was acquisitions, mergers, the people around me started to change, the organizational structure started to change. I thought to myself, why am I doing this? I, I mean, I don't need this anymore. I've been working for years towards lean fire. I've been focusing on Lean Fire since 2010. I, I don't need the stress anymore. Fuck that stress and fuck the corporate world. So 2016 was a year of transitions for me. I slowly transitioned away from the corporate world as a financial controller and CPA to focusing on my real estate empire and just documenting my journey on YouTube for you guys on this channel. And so I was really lucky over the last five, 10 years building up my real estate empire. And I have tons of people to thank for it. Steeper, Zwambeg, Scott, Gertz, Densmore, and Glavin. You guys all had a huge impact on my life and the trajectory I took. And your support and help throughout my Lean Fire journey means the world to me and I wouldn't be here without you guys. So again, thank you so much. And so my goal with Lean Fire always was just to really create opportunities for myself, create a white space where I would be able to take advantage of those opportunities. So in 2016, I was really focused on transitioning to real estate investing full time. As part of that, I knew I need to grow my team. And my first step in growing my team was finding a great real estate agent. Thankfully, I randomly found Jeff Weibel, who's the best real estate agent I know, particularly for investors. We also even started a limo tour together where we started trying to teach and train and help others get involved into the real estate investing market in London, Ontario. He also dresses really fancy and is constantly focused on social media. At the time, I didn't get it at all. So Jeff was all about social media at this time. I still didn't get it back then. Then I started watching Gary V, who's all focused on the entrepreneurial hustle, the grinding. He's also all about social media. And then I started reading Self Made by Stefan Arneo. Remember that name, it'll come up later. And in Self Made, Stefan constantly talked about the need to build legitimacy and how to create legitimacy for yourself as a real estate investor, how to attract other investors with money that want to invest with you as the talent, as the brains behind the operation. It became apparent I needed to start taking the social media way more seriously if I really wanted to grow my real estate empire or even just become better known in my community. So to me, YouTube seemed the fastest way to gain legitimacy. I was gonna show people what I was doing rather than constantly telling them via email. Show them on YouTube rather than tell them via email. I want people to know what I was doing. I want people to get excited. I want people to get involved. Okay, makes sense. Start a YouTube channel. So I stopped being a social media ghost and started teaching people exactly how to implement the Burr investing strategy in Canada. I think I did a pretty good job. I laid out the exact strategies and tactics I was using in my market. But other than a small group of hardcore fans, it was crickets. No one was paying attention. Whatever, Gary Vee says you gotta grind away. You just gotta keep working. Okay, I'll keep doing more, more, more. Also during this time, I met Dylan and Kellen. Dylan was a young, hungry real estate investor who, the moment I saw him, I knew he was going somewhere far. He's a natural guru or coach. Kellen was a property virgin at the time who asked a ton of questions and constantly seemed like a deer in the headlights. Fast forward a year, and Kellen's one of the sharpest, most astute investors I know, who's constantly growing his portfolio and focusing on implementing every new strategy and tactic he learns along the way. So then, Dylan, Kellen, and myself met Michael Rosehart, who's also a crazy young real estate investor here in London, Ontario, who actually just achieved Lean Fire himself. And so, the four of us together end up creating the meetup group, London on Fire, where we're focused on just helping people reach financial independence as soon as possible in London, Ontario, by helping share the strategy and tactics we're using, but also just creating a community that's focused on helping each other out. It's about creating win-win. Remember, making money is a team sport. If you haven't been to London on Fire yet, you need to check it out. If you don't live within driving distance, you need to start your own. So, I kept grinding away on YouTube, creating content. Then, I saw an opportunity. 
Steph Arneo, you remember him from earlier, he wrote Self Made. He was coming to London, Ontario to give a talk, a free presentation about being a real estate investor and how to take your real estate investing to the next level. So, me and Dylan got together and made a series of videos focused on documenting the strategies and tactics that we've learned from Stefan Arneo through all his great content. So the reason we're doing this sort of video today, me and Dylan, is essentially it's just that Gary V uh, jab, 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 right hook. And so we know that Stefan Arneo is going to be coming to our city beautiful city of London, Ontario sometime in the next month or two uh, to do kind of like a seminar or talk or whatever. And so essentially, we just want to get on his radar before he even comes to our city. And so essentially, we're shooting just a free commercial with Dylan here as the star. <laughs> and uh, we're just going to be kind of like pitching his books, pitching his course, pitching his like partnership deals, like just all that stuff, essentially just trying to provide value to him. And uh, right now, it's kind of perfect timing for us to do this because I just saw earlier this week on social media he said he's going to start doubling down on his video content and so we're essentially just going to create free video content for him. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully uh, by the time he comes to London, Ontario, he'll uh, be he'll know our names. Yeah. He'll know who we are and uh, that's the right hook. He'll approach us instead of us having to approach him. <laughs> Long story short, we got his attention, and I'm flying out to Winnipeg tomorrow to move in with him into his penthouse condo to start whipping his YouTube channel into shape. He mentioned a valet, a butler, a cook. Needless to say, it's a different world than anything I'm familiar with. Honestly, I'm not sure where this all leads. I'm going to keep doing my YouTube channel. My YouTube channel is going to be focused on lean fire as always, and I'll also pepper in all kinds of real estate investing and just other personal updates about my life. But in addition to that, for at least the next three weeks, I'm going to be focused on creating content for Stefan Narnio and helping whip his YouTube channel into shape. I really hope you guys check it out and join me along this journey as well. This is the type of opportunity I want to be able to take advantage of. This is why I chased Lean Fire. This is why Lean Fire is so important to me. So, I hope you guys continue to follow along with me on my journey. Hit that subscribe button. I hope you consider checking out Stefan Narnio's channel. Hit that button. And YouTube wants to check out this video. And until next time, remember, making money is a team sport and Lean Fire is about creating options. Thanks. Bye.